Ever wonder about the ongoing conflict in Ukraine that's been simmering for years? The story unfurls like a complex tapestry, full of tension, strategic moves, and the resilience of a people determined to safeguard their homeland. Let's delve into this tale, beginning in April 2021, when Ukraine's foreign minister, Dmitry Kuleba, urged Western allies to impose new sanctions on Russia. His plea was not merely a diplomatic move, it was a call to arms, a request for help in deterring further military aggression against Ukraine. The tensions were palpable as Russian troops amassed on Ukraine's eastern border and in Crimea. Fast forward to September 2022. Ukrainian troops made significant gains, recapturing territory from Russia. Yet even as the scales tipped in Ukraine's favor, Europe braced for a recession. Europe's reliance on natural gas from Russia had left it vulnerable, and the energy crisis sparked by Russia's invasion was taking its toll. The economic outlook for Germany and the UK worsened, and a slowdown in China threatened to further impact German exports. October of the same year marked a significant shift in the narrative. Russian President Vladimir Putin appointed Sergei Surovikin as the new overall commander for operations in the war in Ukraine. Surovikin, known for his brutality, was a stark symbol of Russia's determination to continue the war. His appointment coincided with a heavy bombardment of Ukraine, a chilling reminder of the conflict's harsh reality. As the conflict continues, it's easy to feel overwhelmed by the intricate web of events and the high stakes involved. But remember, knowledge is power. Staying informed about the situation in Ukraine is not merely an act of passive consumption, it's a step towards understanding global politics, recognizing human resilience, and standing in solidarity with those fighting for their homeland. Take this story with you, hold it close, and let it fuel your curiosity about the world. Seek out reliable news sources, talk about the issue with friends and family, and if you feel so moved, consider supporting organizations that provide aid to those affected by the conflict. The Ukraine conflict isn't just a story, it's a testament to the resilience of a nation and its people, a stark reminder of the costs of war, and a call to action for all of us to stay informed and involved. Remember, every voice matters, and together we can make a difference.